hello viewers today we will see how to do t test hypothesis testing using excel so here we have hypothesis of value of 60 and uh, alpha of 10 percent and roll number of 1 to 10 and obtain mark of them so at first we will find the sample size to find sample size the rules is count count and first bracket and you need to drag the roll number cell and next we have to find out average mark to find out average mark the rules is, is equal to average and drag the obtained mark cell column and next is sample standard deviation you know to find t test we need to sample standard deviation and the rules is stdev dot s and drag the obtained mark cell and next is t calculated value so to calculate t calculated value you need to first uh, x bar minus hypothesis value divided by sample standard deviation and again divided by square root so for square root we will use sqrt first bracket and the sample size so 0 0.5765 rt calculated value and our degree of freedom is equal to n minus k minus 1 so this is ultimately 9 here k is equal to 0 so p value from t table is equal to t dist first bracket t calculated value comma degree of freedom and our types of tail test is one so here we use one if you have two tail test you will use two instead of one there so for decision making we will use the rules of if so you first bracket p value is greater than alpha so the true statement will be do not reject null hypothesis and the false statement will be reject null hypothesis so after you hitting the enter button you will see the result so here it shows do not reject null hypothesis because the p value is 2.2892 which is greater than alpha 0 0.1